Nothing is worse than getting great software and not knowing how to use it, not understanding how to get that look that you want. You can see it in your mind, but you just can't get there. Or you see somebody else do it and you're wondering, how did they do that? I want to show you, based on whatever level you're at, how to become an expert in the Nick collection. I'm Mark Wallace, and in my 30 plus years of shooting portraiture, commercial photography, and travel photography, I've learned that what matters is not just the click of the shutter, but the entire workflow, including the post-production. I think I met Mark close to 15 years ago. He was one of the first and the few photographers teaching photography online at the time. He's an amazing photographer, but he's an even better educator and we knew that he was the perfect person to teach the full Nick Collection. The Nick Collection is a complete suite of tools that addresses any editing need you have. For this tutorial, our goal wasn't just to focus on software. We want you to come away completely confident using these programs, but more importantly, the goal is to walk away from this tutorial as a better photographer with better finished photographs. The Nick Collection gives you a tool to create your own unique style and then apply that to your body of work in a way that I've never seen before. Go into your custom presets. I'm gonna go into this one right here, Smoke Boca. Remember that's in your workshop files folder so you can add that yourself. I'm gonna click on that and notice that it blurs the smoke to the right and the left but it keeps the center in focus and then there it is. We have the whole thing. We're gonna be approaching this from so many different angles. It doesn't matter if you're a portrait photographer, fine art photographer, scenic photographer, architectural photographer. The Nick Collection has great tools for all types of photography. In this tutorial, we're gonna be looking at the Nick Collection in depth. Whether you're a beginner, an intermediate, or an advanced user, there's something in this tutorial for you. This software gives you the tools to add effects that you're not gonna find anywhere else. Specifically, this is gonna give you the best black and white processing on the planet. Notice how all the skin texture, the eyelashes, the eyeball, everything becomes really pronounced. It's similar to sharpening, but it's a, a more of an intelligent way to sharpen an image. So we can say we only want to make more details arrive here in the highlights, so we can adjust that. Or we can say we want to do that in the midtones or the shadows or the blacks. We have just a lot of control of how this works. If you're a photographer who doesn't love monthly subscription fees, then this is great for you because you can use all of the Nick collection as a standalone app. But if your workflow includes Photoshop, Lightroom, Affinity, Photolab, you can use the Nick collection. It's seamlessly integrated with all of those apps. And I'm gonna show you how to use them both ways, as a standalone app and as a plugin. This tutorial is eight unique lessons, one for each app. Nick Color Effects gives you the ability to combine different filters, up to 58 different filters. And I'm gonna show you how you can use those to create your own custom presets and define your own creative style. In Silver Effects, we're going to explore black and white photography the way it used to be in the darkroom to create amazing black and white images. In Nick Analog Effects, we're going to take a journey back in time to the days when we shot with analog cameras, when they had problems with distortion and light leaks and grain and photo plates. We can apply all of those looks to our images and it's going to give them a brand new look. In Nick Viveza, I'm going to show you how you can quickly realize your creative vision by changing the color and tonality of your image. If there's any application that I trust to denoise my images, it's Nick Define. It allows me to choose the problem areas without affecting the rest. A lot of photographers don't realize that images go through two sharpening stages, in the camera, when you convert your raw image, and also right before output. With Nick Sharpener, I'm gonna teach you how to do both of those things to their best ability. Nick HDR Effects allows you to save those scenes that you think are unrecoverable. I will show you how to use a single image to do tone mapping to get the darkest darks to the brightest brights in the same image, or take multiple images with bright highlights and dark darks and blend them for a well-defined scene. Nick Perspective allows you to correct any geometrical problem in your image using vertical and horizontal adjustments and my favorite, the reshape tool. 
We're also going to be covering DxO Pure Raw. It is the ultimate tool for converting raw images and preparing them for post-production. You can correct optical distortion, sharpen your images, and use artificial intelligence to denoise your images in the most amazing way. DxO Pure Raw is the best noise reduction software I have ever seen hands down. I know when I'm learning new software, I need to do it myself in the program. I can't just watch someone do it. And that's why it was so important that we included all of the same files that Mark is using that you can download yourself and follow right along with him on your own computer. Building your body of work is incredibly important because you want people to see that you're not just a one-shot wonder, but you have an entire catalog of amazing images that showcases your style and your abilities. By the end of this tutorial, you're going to know a completely new way to edit your photos, and I guarantee you it's going to take your portfolio to the next level.